hi my little roses so i ended up getting my septum pierced yesterday this is what it looks like i hope this is a review of it um and in this video i'm going to be telling you like the process it went through not i still need to make a video on like the healing process of my belly button piercing but this i'm going to explain like what what the process it was to like have this pierce what i what I felt before, during, and then afterwards, and how she pierced it, and all that other stuff. And, but before I get into all that, I wanted to like explain what exactly the measurements and stuff. But I'm still learning about the whole piercing terminology, so uh, this is like a mouthful for me. But this is a 16 gauge, 3 8 diameter. Stainless steel circular barbell. I think that, yeah, circular barbell. And it is mo most commonly known as a horseshoe ring, but people get mad. People, people get mad that they are called that because it's not the correct terminology. So I'm going trying to go by the correct terminology so I don't make people mad. And I myself am interested in becoming a piercer. Not, not like now. I'm, I'm still a minor, but like I'm trying to learn the whole process. But I'm a minor, and hopefully do that as like a side thing, not a full term thing, or something like that. Or at least be able to get my piercing license. I think it's called a lot of other stuff. Anyway, I'm, I'm ranting away. I'm going to be saying like the whole story. So I went to a, I went to a local tattoo and piercing shop. And it's the same piercing shop that I went to for my other three piercings, which would be my second one, because from that end of the room, I'm going to get that rear pierced and um, my belly. I got it pierced, and this is the third time I went, and this, I got in, I got another piercer I've never had before, but she made me feel really comfortable, and I don't know why, I don't know what was different, but I don't, she was very nice, but the way that she... It was an interesting way to get pierced, I would say that. Because like I was like, this is either gonna not hurt at all or it's gonna hurt like hell. Either one. And she laid me down. I know there are people who get pierced sitting up in a chair. She laid me down, so I got pierced laying down. And people are probably gonna be like, that's the wrong way or whatever, but I don't know the correct way. This is how I was pierced. I like the outcome of this was. I mean, I'm pretty sure it was not pierced in cartilage, but I can't be sure, because it hurt. People are going to be like, did it hurt? Yes, it hurt a lot. Um, on the pain scale, I would have to say it hurt 7 out of 10, I think, because it hurt, but it didn't hurt as much as my navel, because my navel, oh my god, 8, eight and a half out of 10, and she was like, really? And I was like, yeah, like, she's like, those pieces aren't really supposed to hurt, I was like, I have very little pain on She's like, oh, that's why. I'm like, yeah, this this, this is this stuff is not fun. I love piercing, so I go check it out. I go for it with it. So she laid me down, and she had, like, this whole set right next to her on, like, this, I don't know what you would call it, but, like, I think it was, like, it was, like a movable tray. One of those. She laid me down, and got behind me, and she, boop, boop, yeah, I can't speak. She took up the, the clamps. Clamps, these were just... Yeah, I'm pretty sure these were different plants rather than the um, ones with the circle. I um, think I can't be sure I can really see them, but it, it just felt a little different. I might have been wrong, but it's the one like this. That's more. It's not like oval shaped. It's more just plain like that. Like you just put it on, and there's like a little hole in this horizontal. Is not the right word. Sorry. The, the I've seen piercers do it on like YouTube. They have that little bar, and there's like a little tiny hole, in it and then it's just so I'm pretty sure that's the one she was used. I could be wrong. Um, she um clamped it on, and then she like wiggled it around. She's like, "Does this hurt?" And I was like, "Yes." She was like, "Okay, let me just like, try and see if I can get it." And she put it in. She's like, "Look at the ground." She's like, "Does this hurt?" And I was like, "Yes, it hurts." Oh my god. And it didn't, it wasn't painful enough that I started crying, but like, it, it, it felt really weird, I guess you could say. 
this is like in my nose. Oh, she cleaned it beforehand. I forgot to mention that. She did clean it beforehand. She's wearing gloves. All the sanitary stuff that was like, I really look, yeah. I don't know what she used though. She was like, I'm gonna clean your nose. She's trying to come there. And I'm in my eyes water. Um, she cleans it every time trying to wiggle it, wiggle it around. She's like, is this her? And I was like, yes. And she was like, it's moving freely. I don't think it's cartilage. I was like, I don't know anymore. Her. <laughs> And this is like a different kind of experience because for me, my belly person, she like sends it on and boink, calls it. This is just like making sure it's not hitting cartilage. So this is a lot different to me. Um, I think it took her like four, four times, I think. Or she claimed it and uh, she was like, does it hurt? I was like, yes. She's like, does it hurt as much? I was like, no, I'm sorry. She's like, she was like, really? I think it's okay. She was she, And it was coming up. But she she kind of, she was like, just breathe in. Like, she was kind of just breathe in, breathe out. And um, I felt like a point, but that wasn't it. And I was like, was that it? And then I felt it just. But like someone was giving me a shot in my nose, like a syringe was like putting something in my nose, like in, in injecting something in my nose. That's exactly what it felt like. It felt like someone was just like, <laughs> it hurt. It, it, it really hurt. Like I told you, it was about a seven. I think that's my name. I think my name was or I'm but um I have a very low pain tolerance, so um yeah, and then. She got the jewelry and really quickly, and she was like, can you sit up now? She's like, are you okay? Are you dizzy? I'm like, no, it just kind of hurts. And then my eyes were like, boring. I'm not even sneeze though. I know people, there are, there are people who have sneezed. I did not sneeze, thank God. I was not one of the people that sneezed. I thought she was balling, and she, like, she told me what to clean it with and all that other stuff, and I got annoyed with that, because there are people who probably give you crap. They're like, that's not what you clean it with. Well, this is what worked for me. And that's what my piercing shop told me, and it works well for me, so I'm gonna do what's best for me. So, yeah, this is what it is. It's a little freaking now. I'm kind of afraid to touch it. It's, um, I'm, my hands, yeah, isn't that really good? I don't want, I don't want to touch it. That's a problem. I really shouldn't touch it. I was cleaning, so that's what I'm gonna do. And she said it should take like six to eight weeks to heal. I'm gonna keep the starter jewelry in a tuck time until it doesn't hurt anymore, until that eight week mark is good. And I'm gonna probably, I think, um, the most of my weight would be two months. I think just about. I hope it's still not healed, but then I'll probably go back. But this is a long video. This is my experience. And I can't tell the Tristan cards. People were saying that if it's pierced every card, as you can tell. I mean, it hurt, but people were, I didn't like feel any or hear any bone from them. She's like, I don't like hit the car with because it went there really freely. I'm just like, I hope so too. Because I, cause I know this one YouTuber, hers took a lot longer to heal because it was pierced down the cartilage and it was also pierced low. But I like the way mine is pierced. If you don't like this piercing, well, I do. So your opinion is kind of invalid. But I, I, if you don't like this piercing, I really agree with Alicia because I think it's really cool. The pain is bearable because like I said my belly piercing hurt a lot more. Yeah, this see. That's where it's pierced. I'm trying not to move because it hurts because it's right there. And I did sting it afterwards for a few hours so I'm kinda of, so I was kinda of just like don't want to touch my face. It doesn't hurt now but if I move it around it'll sting so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure I think, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you like me. I'll be pr getting more piercings along the way. Just not any. I don't know if I'll get any more anytime soon. This is a long video, but I'll see you guys next time. Bye.